truly and blessed Jesus Christ, the perfect radiance of the eternal Heavenly Father, who enlightens us with joy. As dust was in upon us, and the evening lights appear, we sing our praise-filled hymns to God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Son of God, you deserve that every age joyfully sing your praise, for you give life, and so all the world gives to you its glory. As the day comes to an end, we say together, I acknowledge my sin to you. I do not cover over my iniquity. I confess my transgressions to you, and you forgive the guilt of my sin. Confident that those who seek the Lord God are thus assured of his peace, we say tonight, I lay my soul, my body, and all that I am into the enfolding embrace of the Father who loves me, into the enfolding embrace of Jesus who gave his life as a ransom for me, into the enfolding embrace of the Spirit who lives within me. Tonight I lay my soul, my body, and all that I am into the enfolding embrace of the threefold God, and there I find my rest. Lord, we acknowledge that your word is a lamp for our feet and a light on our paths. And so we read Romans chapter 8 and verses 1 and 11. Therefore, there is now no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. And if the spirit of him who raised Jesus from the dead is living in you, he who raised Christ from the dead will also give life to your mortal bodies because of his spirit who lives in you. Lord Jesus, no condemnation. How we glory in those two words, life from the dead. What an experience and what a prospect. Lord Jesus, we love you. As the fountain in the garden, as the candle in the dark, as the treasure in the coffer, as the manna in the ark, so, Lord, are you to me. Thus may the sacred three, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, save, shield, and surround me, my home, my loved ones, my friends, and my world, and give to all his peace.